Hey guys, in this video we are going to learn how to create the entity relationship diagram of our POS system. So I'm using lucid chart to create this diagram and then this is a, a template so I'm going to delete some of this uh, table so this one I don't need this so here we have a simple table name supplier and then let's rename this one to invoice so inside the invoice table we'll have the primary key um, so usually it's an id then here we have customer id so in our app we need also to capture the uh, sample data uh, or basic information of the customer and then we have the total amount so let's just add more rows then we can add the user id so basically this is the the id of the user um, so in our case the login user and then we also have the amount uh, tender uh, let's think um let's uh add also i guess the the change uh the amount change uh so let's just add first the date created and then the date updated then here let's insert a row and this will be the change amount so let's just use change so now let's try to duplicate this uh, table so just hold you can just copy and then paste or use the control alt so let's have the customer so basically we have the id uh, here we can delete that one uh, just capture the name of the customer the address and then contact number so this one should be date updated also this one date updated and then here I'm going to delete these properties then let's connect the customer id so actually this should be reverse so customer should or can have multiple invoices or invoice belongs to the customer so next is so let's just duplicate this table um, yeah, let's just copy and paste and then this will be the user table so this user we don't need 
to add this one to our uh, database since this user's data will be pulled from the inventory management system project so once we finish this one we're going to integrate these two projects so the inventory and then the this point of sale system so the same thing the user has or can process multiple invoices or invoice so next thing we need to add here um, so let's duplicate again So here we can use or add invoice item. So here we'll have a uh, record of the products. So uh, inside an invoice we have different products purchased by the customer. So we need to link the invoice to the invoice item. so that should be inside the user id column and then here it should be pointed or connected to the invoice item so an invoice contains multiple item or multiple um, product so actually um, let's just use sales and then here let's sales item sales items so this one we don't need this one so let's just replace that one with the product ID and then here we need to uh, the total amount uh, let's let me think uh, so let's add the quantity ID So I already added the product ID, so I can also add the unit price. Then I can also add the, the subtotal. Then date rated and date updated. So it's looking good um, here. Uh, the same with the user table um, the product table will be pulled from our inventory uh, management system so this looks good um, let's try to add the note uh, or let's just update this one so this should be date Updated. Then let's add a note or a text something. Um, so if you can also use uh, UML tools to build instead of Lucid Chart. Uh, but I find this one easy to use. So that's why I use this one. Um, just copy this one and then paste and then update the text so as you can see we have created the sample um, database system are the ERD diagram in the theory relationship diagram of our point of sale system so we have the sales so which is connected by the customer ID and also the user ID or the one who processes the invoice we have the change and the date created date updated then the sales has sales items so we have here the 
breakdown of the products, the quantity purchased, unit price, and the subtotal, and then also the product and the user, which is coming from our inventory management system. Then here the customer, we have info like the name, um, address, so we can use this one if we have a point system in our inventory or you know discount 